Bartenders who ask who is next. One of my biggest pet hates is this. This does me head in more than anything, right? Well, there's a lot that does me head in, but this is one of them, the main ones. You go in a bar, right? And you walk in, and there's one person serving behind the bar, and you're like, where's, where's, what if you need a piss? Number one, right? That, that means you're gonna have to leave the bar unattended. Should be at least two people on a bar at all times, mm -hmm. or two people covering, one collecting glasses, one serving, or two people serving when it gets busy, whatever it may be. And what they do, one person on the bar, they're serving someone and you walk up to the bar. Just you and this one person being served. And you go, hi, and they go, hi. And so they've made contact with you, right? They've contacted you, looked at you in the face, said hello. They know you're stood there, right? So they finish serving this guy next to me, right? By this time, seven or eight people come to the bar and she's got a face, she's looking alright, he's looking at the, the register with the back to the bar now. And they go, did it, did it, did it, right? Finish on, she turns around and they go, who's next? Fucking, you knew it was me. Because you just said hello to me, right? But then someone else goes, someone else who wants to jump the queue is thinking, oh, I've seen an opportunity here. He'll go, oh, can I have a... And I'll go, whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm next. You knew that to the bartender. Now I'm going to cause a delay because she needs to learn that when she's serving people, the person who stood there first is next. That's how it works. That's how they should be trained. The amount of bars have walked out of because I've gone, who's next? Some guys are gone, fuck it, I'm out. I'll go somewhere else. And then I'll never go in that pub again because it's useless. It's about good customer service, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. yeah, and it happens a lot. Just bad training from people. Mm -hmm. Common sense tells you. I know he was next because I seen him stood there. And that's, that's the only job you've got to do, really. Pay attention to what's going on at the bar. What people need, what people serve. Get everyone served as quick as possible. And when their drinks start getting low, fill them up. That's what you're making money on. That's how you're making money as a business. The amount of times I'm sat in a bar when it's table service and they walk past you and they look at your empty drink and I go, drink's empty. Do you want another one? Well, I wouldn't be sat here if I didn't. I'm not fucking here just to hang out. I'm here to drink beer. You know what I mean? And that's what you get with the bartenders who are just hopeless people sometimes. And these are college kids sometimes and university student, students who are coming in and supposed to be the smartest people we've got in the country. Yeah, they're not even the smartest person behind the bar. There's only two of them. 